Well, welcome back to Rebellion Offroad. Uh, this week's episode is going to be the draw that we've been promising about the Rebellion Offroad knife. Uh, I think we're going to be choosing a winner right now. Yes, we are. I am actually going to pick a name out of our little orange bowl, bucket, whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, let's get started on that. Um, do you want to show the knife again, Paul? Or are we yeah, let's show, let's show what that winner is going to win. Okay, so this is the knife in the pouch that it comes in. And this is the knife. It's pretty cute. It's a little knife. It's not uh, not too big, but I don't know how you show a knife, but is that Usually there? point down. Point down? Yeah. Point down? Point down. Okay. And it says right across Rebellion Off-Road. So we got it inscribed. We want to thank all the entry uh, people that have put their names in. Yeah. It's been a pretty good successful. And uh, I wish I had a knife for everyone that uh, entered the draw. <laughs> uh, but to all the other subscribers out there, we want to thank you for watching our videos and everybody else has been tuning in lately. Yeah, and participating yeah. Um, in whatever we, we have going out, you know, comments and, and this contest too, because it yeah. means a lot to us and we just want to show appreciation and this is how we're going to be doing it. So without further ado, drum roll, will. please. Okay. And the winner of the knife is... Isla Wairong. Yeah. Okay, Isla, you are the winner of the Rebellion Off-Road Night. So uh, we will be contacting you. Congratulations. We are so excited to send it to you. Do um, you have anything to say, Paul? No, I just, uh, this weekend we're going to be heading out to the Alberta Overland Expo. I think it's it's, everybody <laughs> gets screwed up. I don't know why it's such a difficult abbreviation. It's A O A E. So okay, that's that's so. where it is. And we're going up this weekend. So we went last year and had a blast. So we're going to be up there this weekend. We hope to see anyone who wants to come up there. Or who watches uh, the YouTubers out there. There's going to be more YouTubers than just us. And it's there, not just so. YouTubers. It's everybody who wants to partake in overlanding. Yeah, and, common interest, right? Yeah, they have everything out there. Lots of fun for kids and stuff. Uh, you can get a weekend pass or just a day to day, like Saturday or a Sunday pass. Uh, just go on their website. And once again, it's A O A E and uh, Alberta Overland Adventure Expo is what it's called. I think what we're going to do is uh, for our second place uh, person, we're going to send out a, a t shirt. Yeah, a Rebellion Off Road t shirt. And each winner will receive the Rebellion Off Road sticker too. So. That's our sticker. Um, I mean, I'm sure if you do watch our videos, it's all over our vehicles, it's all over our trailer. Um, so we'll be sending you out our, uh, some stickers and um, the second place winner will receive a t-shirt and we will contact that person to um, get your size and, and address and whatnot. So, drum roll Paul for the second place winner. Woody Lopez. So, Woody Lopez, you win a Rebellion Off-Road t-shirt. So, we will be contacting you to get your size and, and we'll your address. You one up. Yeah, we'll order you one up and you'll get the uh, Rebellion Off-Road sticker and your t-shirt. That was our giveaway and we thank everybody once again for participating in, in the contest. Yeah, so this week's video uh, is going to be something that I've done on the weekend and I think anybody who owns one of these off-grid trailers and even the manufacturer manufacturing these off-grid trailers I think we got a great idea for you and I think yeah. you should put it in all your uh, trailers I think it's great we're gonna show you though and we're gonna see if you can figure it out and I am a lucky woman to have such a creative man like Paul or just an electrician in general. yeah maybe that too but he's got some pretty darn good ideas so we're gonna reveal we'll see What did you ask for again? I don't know. Spatula or something? Sure. <laughs> Jelly beans. You know me and candy, Paul. Oh, so where does... How see. do you see in there? Let me see. They got a switch somewhere up here. Somewhere up there. Let's see. Oh <laughs> I can't God. even see. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Wow, we can see a lot. So here. yeah, so this is <coughs> the light that the manufacturer put in. As you can see, you'll lose the bottom half of your stuff because you can't see. You can see just a little bit of light that shines, but wow, what is this, Paul? That's now, this is what I call a lit up pantry. Yeah, and it right? just makes sense to me. So Paul installed some LED strips, uh, pretty bright, along the side of the pantry, all along the side of the pantry. He can control it with his phone. Um, yeah, I mean, I just, this compared to what it was before is is a vast contrast and and i'm loving it um you can see everything and every shelf hey eh, paul yeah now take a look inside what we did okay. there as well okay so this is uh what the interior looks like and you know we can't see to the end you can't see anything back there right so what do i do i go on and wow voila so now we got a gallery that we can see all of our stuff. It's easy to find, you know, it's deep shelves. That's another drawback. I love the amount of storage, but they're just too deep, I think, for the average person. You know, you'd have to crawl in back. the back. Yeah, it's just too much, I think. But, you know, if they shrunk them down a bit, probably give you more room to move around. But uh, not a complaint, just a better, you know, better way to go. So now we are lit like a Christmas tree, right? Yes. So when I say I'm a lucky gal having Paul, I'm a lucky gal. So this is great. This makes a big difference in my world that I can see when you're cleaning, when you're, you know, unloading, loading, just, just about everything. So and what else we put on those upper lights? We put this yellow film on. Oh yeah. I don't um, want to blind you. I'll just go to the out, outside. Yeah. Here. Ooh, that so is we put bright. a yellow light on. So now we can see her. Yeah, now you can see me. Yeah, this trailer is lit. We yeah. got our Starlink that's going to be up there. I think we're ready for the expo. Yeah, I think I think we're ready. Okay, guys. Until the next time, we'll see, see you on the next, the next one. one. Take care. Take care.